Bye bye Costa de la Calma. Okay, this is amazing. I have just arrived at my friend's place. The villa is so nice. And this is my room that I've been given. This is where I'm going to stay. This is the guest room. This is so good. I love it. There is the dining table outside. I don't know if you can see the dining table outside. It's just by the mini pool. And there's a pool upstairs as well. This is just a vibe. I'm just going to chill for a bit. I need to take out some of my clothes and put them in the hanger here just to make myself comfortable. I need to hang some of my clothes. I came with a few clothes. My shorts. Another shot. Okay, that was it. I'm just going to chill now. I will catch you guys later. I'm in Port Andreas or Port Andrea. No, I don't know. It's Port Andrea. Andreas. Okay, okay, just have a look. We drove up here from the villa and we're just going to walk on the promenade. This place is so nice. I would love to be visiting here like all the time. Are you taking in the fresh air? It's so cool. I love it here. Amazing. Is that a... Oh God, I can't remember the name now again. Oh, what's that called now? Oh. Mountain house. Ship. No, 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 no. Those boats. Um, no, it's not a yacht. It's, it starts with a C. Uh, no. Oh God, I can't remember the name now. Catamaran. Catamaran, yeah. Yeah, I'm sure they have some here. No, that's a catamaran. Yeah, possibly. Is this where the restaurant is? Oh, we're going to come later. No, we go to uh, Port uh, Portals. Okay, okay. The summer this year has been up and down. This is summer. I feel like I'm literally having my summer now. I kid you not, because the weather has been higgy haga. The weather has been up and down. And now I'm having a proper summer. And this is so good this is so good i love it and my sweat is going into my eyes we're just going to go to the car now maybe find something cooler to drink some cold drinks okay we just found this supermarket we just want to get some cold drinks before we get to the car we just want to get water in the supermarket here We are walking over to see the ocean, the ocean view. Some of the houses here are so expensive. You can tell. Let's go to the beach, 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 beach. just come in it was so cool and i will have to shower before we go to dinner later i'm just going to go and get something cold to drink in the sitting room anyway later i just had a shower and i'm ready we're going to dinner in a few minutes time this top is from hugo boss and i'm wearing this black denim pants from weekday i am going to wear my white puma sneakers i'm loving this place <laughs> see the weather is really really nice i'm wearing this top from lila scott i got this from selfridges in manchester so lila scott rag and bone and i'm wearing this puma sneakers that i came with i only came with one sneakers and this sunglass is from captain and son
are in Parma, but not the center of Parma, so we're going to the center of Parma soon. The weather is so nice here. Yeah. We're waiting for someone to check something in the store and then we will, we will, we will, we will drive off. We just arrived at Parma. That's the Parma Cathedral. This is so good. Oh my days, the weather is amazing. I was just filming the cathedral from the car. Can you just see? This is nice. Wow, I love this. So cool. Literally everyone is taking picture here. Yeah? So sweaty. I have never been this sweaty. But the good thing is the air is fresh and nice and lovely. This is so good. Are we going to go for a tour? Okay, so we're going to go for a tour. Are you not sweating? Mm -hmm. You're not? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Cathedral. Oh my God. We are in the shopping district of Parma. They have Louis Vuitton here, Massimo Dotti. That cathedral, when I went into that cathedral, I must confess I felt this calm and it feels really, really holy. Like it feels like I was in the presence of God. It was really calm there. And the cathedral is so historic. We're going to go into this tunnel. That is our tour of Parma for the afternoon done. We're going to come back here in the evening from what I've been told for dinner. This is so good. The weather is extremely kind. It has been extremely kind. Mr. Selfie, can I join on the selfie? We just took a selfie. When we go back to the villa, I need to shower, freshen up. We went into this particular department store. They had like Gant, Braff Lauren. I did not bother to pick up the camera. And we walked around the city. Sometimes you just need to leave the camera behind and enjoy the moment, experience the moment, and then pick up the camera again. And that's what I did. This is so good. So, so good. I love it. Look at this. So nice. Sunbathing. That was so good. I need to shower because we have dinner to go to. There's music playing in the background and things. Oh my days. It was so good at Palma today and we're going back there this evening for dinner and I can't wait. I am super excited. So super excited to go there. Ah, this place is so calm. So, so good. It's so good here. So I'm just going to go outside again for a bit and then come and shower quickly and get ready to go out to dinner. Oh, I've been in the sun. I think I have some time. I should turn a bit. Yeah. I'm just going to go outside again. <sighs> we literally have like, um, say about 30 minutes to get ready. We are going to dinner. I'm ready. The weather is so good. We're going to somewhere in Palma for dinner. I'm excited. It's so good because we were there this afternoon and I loved it. So cool. We just arrived at our destination. We are going to the restaurant. He's trying to make payment for the car park and then we'll go to the restaurant. We 
just got in. I'm going to go to the terrace. I'm not outside, close to the pool to drink. We're going to have gin and tonic. I don't really like alcohol, but we're going to do it this evening. This restaurant that we went to, the food I just think is a rip off. I ordered this risotto. Two of us, it was the three of us on the table. So two of us ordered this lobster risotto. The lobster risotto came. I was expecting a chunk of lobster, like a really, really big chunk of lobster. What happened? There was barely no lobster in the food. Some of these luxury restaurants and places just do some madness. And it's overpriced. It's literally rice. Hello? In two minutes, I'll be there. I just think it's a ripoff. Like, literally a ripoff. I mean, it doesn't make any sense. The place is good and the area is good. But I just feel like if you're going to say it's lobster risotto, there should be some lobster in the risotto. Like, there was nothing. And we told them about this. We told them we were like, this is overpriced for what it is. It was a good experience. Don't get me wrong. But I just feel like sometimes some of these places just sell the name, the location and things like this. The good thing is that I had a good time because I sat with my friends. We had a wonderful time. No, this is just not on. You can't just sell this to people and think it's okay for us to pay this extortionate amount for something that is not really worth the price. The restaurant is beautiful. Their service is beautiful and everything. But the food, that particular lobster, lobster risotto rubbed me the wrong way. Anywho, I'll catch you later. Every single way. Smile reminds me Good morning. I just woke up not long ago. Yesterday was amazing. We had a blast. My flight is later on this evening at 7.40. Before then, there's so much more to do on the island because the weather is amazing. It is so magnificent here. Very, very refreshing. <laughs> We just came back from Brecky. We went to the same breakfast place we went to yesterday. I didn't bother to record when I got there. I just wanted to eat the food and relax. It is slightly more humid today. We want to go and swim for a bit. Just dip in the pool for a bit. I have no plans. I leave in about five hours. That's where my flight is. Oh, it's so good here. So calm. We're just going to jump into the pool. It's a really, really small pool anyway. We're going to Port Andreas. Adriano. And, oh, Port Andriano. Adriano. Okay. Not so, untouched. See, okay, Port Adriano. Andriano. Like the name Adrian. Okay. Adriano. Port Adriano, okay. So this is my last week tour of the island before I get back and get ready for my flight. Every single way, your smile reminds me. We are in Port Andriano. Is it Andriano or Adriano? Andriano. Adriano. Adriano, okay. Do you know what? To park in this place, all the car parks are just reserved. Doesn't make any sense. We drove around like crazy before we finally found one place to park. Can you just see boats everywhere? People have money, <laughs> yeah. honestly. You know what? I can understand why people want to retire here. It makes sense to me perfectly. Good weather, good food, good environment, safe, good air, no hassle. Like, then you need the money. <laughs> By the sound of your heartbeat, my soul is overwhelmed. I find it hard to be discreet. This spot, Adriano, is a vibe. I was just told that it's quite new in comparison to other of the ports, but it's just really nice. Honestly, the weather is good weather, but it can be too much sometimes when it's very, very humid, like it is today. Port Adriano is a vibe, definitely. We are in Magaluf. This Magaluf, there's a lot of shows that I've watched in the past on ITV in the UK where they show things about Magaluf. It's in the afternoon today, but I can see a few things already that tells me that it is actually Magaluf. I am being driven to the airport by by Costa de Palma. <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> Costa de Calma. De la Calma. Bye bye Costa de la Calma. <laughs> 